Hey guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel That Aussie Mum. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Suze and for those of you who do know me, welcome on back. Now, it is the end of the school term, the end of the year for school and it's been a bit hectic. I'm a little bit tired and there's a lot of marking to be done and thus certain things around the house get, you know, neglected. So I just wanted to show you and be real and encourage those other mums out there who are tired and discouraged and feel like they have no time for anything else. I just want you to know <laughs> it's okay. It really is okay. I'm going to show you my house, everything bar the girls rooms and end of the house because that's their job and I don't do that anyway and it's their privacy and I'm not going to go there. But I'm going to show you the rest of the house and show you just how neglected it's been in the last little while. You'll be shocked but this is real life, this is what it is. Come the holidays I will have time to deal with it all but at the moment I am bogged down in marking and reporting and I don't even really have time to do this but I'm making time for it so I hope you feel loved even my garden's neglected look at that cobbler's pegs I hate cobbler's pegs but they're all through my garden because I've had no time even for that so we're gonna head on inside and I'm going to show you what real life is in our household at the moment um, in terms of not having a clean house and it's okay I'm gonna start off down this end of the house this currently is our study and it's a disaster I even have a box of who gives a crap toilet paper sitting in the doorway because it hasn't even been delivered to wherever the toilet paper goes when it goes into storage shoes all sorts of junk under the tables all the paperwork, towels over chairs, pillows on floors. I even have an enormous pile of decluttered clothes and other bits and pieces that need to go to an op shop, but that's gonna have to wait till the holidays. Even these bookshelves are starting to uh, get out of control. Desks are a mess. Just stuff everywhere. The floor is filthy, but you know, is what it is. This is the bedroom. You've seen this before. Again, my dressing table is not too bad. It's usually the first thing to get covered in junk, but I've got a couple of things that need to be dealt with, but it is starting to get dusty. Of course, there are clothes and bags and things on the floor. Look at the dust. So dusty. Daniel's side of the bed's not too bad. Bed's not even made for the day. Didn't even have time to make it. Didn't even have time to make it today. Clothes aren't even fully in the washing basket. I have a floor job. And about five bazillion pairs of shoes under the bed. As well as five bazillion pairs of shoes on the floor in here. Now you will have seen my videos where I have actually purged things and cleaned those areas out, all of these areas, but you know, even this isn't looking as bad as original, but it's still out of control, out of control. Alrighty, back out here. This is my pile of books to be read. This was from my birthday book haul. Yeah, I've got lots of books to read, but that's where they're living at the moment, so they don't go missing. i got a cup of coffee going on. That's still warm, actually. I should probably drink that. But look, there's a shoe. A random shoe. I don't know where its partner is. It's probably under that blanket. Pillows and things everywhere. And more... Dust. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I am pretty sure we are housing some dust bunnies in this place. This is our gym. 
it's very rarely used and as you can see it's a great dumping spot this is where I dump my bags I don't even know I don't even know what's going on under here I don't entirely know what's in there it just is more dumping spots basically any spare surface in my house at the moment is a dumping spot for stuff kitchen's not overly bad but bins need to be emptied they're out at the moment because of the baby gate we can't actually open the bin cupboard and the puppy has been sleeping in the laundry and yeah look I haven't even cleaned up from last night's dinner look at that look at that dishwasher hasn't been fully packed even the laundry is a bit of a mess because of puppy she's actually sleeping outside she slept outside for the last two days but she still has to eat in there because otherwise she steals Lula's food boots girls breakfasts potatoes in a I don't even know why that's there more random stuff again every surface every surface is just covered in stuff just stuff everywhere look at it everywhere we even have a car battery sitting in here to run the car fridge because my fridge is over full laundry that needs to be done puppy hello baby say hi more shoes towels everywhere dog things everywhere even the craft area full of dog things and you guessed it more dust like I said dust bunnies would have a field day girls have been fiddling with my stuff they've been making some little critters but they haven't packed away lounge has got things from my birthday so this was from almost a month ago that hasn't even been picked up I don't know how long that cup's been there you know Piper it's okay baby and then in here we've got abandoned face masks that we're not using my bookshelf needs some serious dusting I mean look at there's a dust bunny look at the dust bunny look at it and they're piling up to the roof I think I need to do a book unhaul I think this is the spare room I'm pretty sure I've done a video on this again it's exploded it's just oh I can't even stuff everywhere I'm not going to take you into the girls bedrooms and things but there's another bookshelf full of, why is there a sleeping bag there like why I don't understand anyway this is their bookshelf and these are all books that they've well outgrown for most part and so I need to do an unhaul on that too and again look at the dust that is that is gross yucky so yeah so for those of you who feel bad about your house well, you know. So the point of this video was to show you that you don't have to be perfect all of the time. Your house does not have to be perfect and under control all of the time. And it's okay. It's okay. If you're tired, rest. It's all still going to be there tomorrow. No one should be telling you that your house needs to be perfect. Your house is lived in. And I mean, if you do have a perfect house, you know what? Kudos. And I mean that, I mean that. Some of us are much better at housekeeping than, the, you know, the rest of us. If you're busy, if you're tired, if it's just too much, you know what? Leave it for another day. It's not, it's, it's still going to be there. And honestly, who really cares if it's messy for a short amount of time? Who cares? Who cares? So if you're feeling discouraged and you feel like it's just too much, you know what? Take a deep breath and understand that I'm here for you. I get it. I am 100% that person. I literally have dust bunnies in my living in my house. I'm surprised they don't actually hop around the house around my feet as I walk around as pets. There's that many of them. 
and you know what that's real life and it is what it is and that is totally okay so be encouraged be encouraged you don't have to be perfect all the time your house doesn't need to be perfect all the time and it is what it is if you need to rest have a rest and that my friends is my current motto so I hope you enjoyed that seeing someone else's very messy house and the fact that it hasn't been clean for months oh well it's what it is so if you enjoyed that video if you enjoyed seeing my mess and <laughs> and and the realness of my house well then give this video a thumbs up and click that red subscribe button down below don't forget to hit the bell you know so you can get notifications of when I show you more videos of my unkempt house and you know leave a comment down below are you like me does your house go out of control like this all the time and you just think oh, I can't keep up or are you the opposite and do you have an immaculate house and if so can I please have some tips because obviously I need those tips just secretly